Did you know that Kate Beckinsale was one of the actresses who was considered a great fit for Wonder Woman? One can only imagine how the movie would have turned out if she actually took on the role. Interestingly, the actress wasn't remotely interested in portraying Wonder Woman. In this video, you will find out why Kate Beckinsale passed on such a life-changing opportunity, the rise of the Underworld star. The world has come to know Kate Beckinsale as a fiercely talented and dedicated actress, but very few people know about her journey to fame and the circumstances that birthed the warrior in her. Born on July 26, 1973 in Chiswick, London, England, Kate was the only child of actors Richard Beckinsale and Judy Lowe. Unfortunately, tragedy hit her family early. Her father passed away from a heart attack when she was just five years old, leaving her and her mother to cope with the loss. Despite this tragedy, Kate found solace in performing arts, and her interests propelled her to study drama at Oxford University's New College. It was there that she began to hone her skills as an actress and explore her passion for the craft. Kate also studied French and Russian literature, which helped her develop a deeper understanding of language and storytelling. After completing her studies, nothing could stop her from pursuing the career of her dreams. Her unique auditions led to her landing small roles in British television shows and movies. Her first major role came in the 1993 TV movie One Against the Wind, in which she played a young woman who joins the French Resistance during World War II. From there, Kate continued to work steadily in British television and film, showcasing her versatility as an actress in various roles. She appeared in the comedy drama Much Ado About Nothing in 1993, followed by the romantic drama Royal Deceit in 1994. In 1995, Kate starred in the TV series Cold Comfort Farm, which earned her a British Academy Television Award for Best Actress. Kate's success in these early roles helped establish her as a rising star in the British acting scene. Her talent and dedication to the craft were evident, and it was clear that she had the potential to make a name for herself on the international stage. In the late 1990s, the actress began to branch out into Hollywood, appearing in films such as The Last Days of Disco and Broke Down Palace. All of her performances showcased her ability to tackle complex characters and storylines with grace and nuance, further establishing her as a talented actress to watch. It became clear that everything she experienced while growing up transformed her into a dogged actress who was passionate about her craft. After several years of pouring her heart into her craft, she finally landed the role which is said to be her breakout role. The actress was chosen to portray Celine in the 2003 action horror film Underworld. This was the role that multiplied her fan base and placed her on an international stage. As the leather-clad vampire warrior, Kate brought a fierce intensity and physicality to the role that captured audiences' attention, establishing herself as a bona fide action star. She proved to a lot of filmmakers that she was capable of taking on any role she was given, even the role of the iconic Wonder Woman, Kate Beckinsale as Wonder Woman. Several years after Patty Jenkins' Wonder Woman film was released, rumors began to circulate that at one point, Kate Beckinsale was chosen to play the lead role in the film. Several media outlets publicized the information and people began to wonder why the actress didn't end up taking the role. If her role in Underworld proved anything, it was the fact that she would excel as a fictional superhero character. Most people who watched and enjoyed the 2017 film Wonder Woman would be shocked to find out that they would have witnessed Kate Beckinsale embodying Wonder Woman instead of Gal Gadot. From the look of things, it seems like the creators of the movie were ready to cast Kate Beckinsale for the movie several years ago. The actress finally addressed the rumors about her early involvement with the film in a 2018 interview with Variety. She confirmed that she had, at one point in time, been attached to play the lead role in the film adaptation of Wonder Woman. The question remains, why did she turn down the role? Why Kate Beckinsale refused to portray Wonder Woman? Kate Beckinsale was one of the actresses who was seen as a possible fit for Wonder Woman at a certain point in time. She was even approached by the then-creators of the show, but she didn't end up taking the role. In a bid to address the rumors, Kate made revelations about the proposed role and why she didn't want to play Wonder Woman at the time. In her words, Yes, there was a period of time, a long time ago, when producer Joel Silver was involved with it. However, she made it clear that she refused to take the role, and she has zero regrets about her decision. 
Most people wondered why the actress would pass up such a life-changing opportunity. Her response immediately clarified the questions in the hearts of many. She said when she was approached, she was given the script they had written for Wonder Woman at the time. As she read it, she realized that the script was not a great one. The things she saw in the script discouraged her from taking the role completely. When an interviewer asked the actress whether or not she regretted passing on the role of Wonder Woman at the time, this was her response. No, it would have been a terrible movie based on the script that I read. Whatever she saw in the script years ago is clearly not the same script that was used in Patty Jenkins' version of Wonder Woman. To date, she doesn't regret not taking the role, because she believes that if the script she read was the script for the movie, it would have flopped. She made the decision to turn down the role in order to protect her career from the possible effects of the movie project failing. Based on everything she revealed, it was clear that she didn't think much of Joel Silver's version of Wonder Woman. She didn't want to take on a project that could damage her career, the embarrassment factor. Aside from the fact that she didn't think the script was great, the actress also had another reason for passing on the role. She didn't want to embarrass her child in the process of making the film. She gave Yahoo Entertainment a detailed explanation of her decision to avoid the embarrassment that came with the role. In her words, I don't know if I was desperate to be in a leotard. I'd already done the rubber trousers. You have to take in that you have a child at some point, and how much could you possibly embarrass them? That's such an oppressive thing. If your mother is Wonder Woman, you're gonna have issues. Her career in recent years. Like fine wine, she has only gotten better with age, showcasing her range as an actress, and proving that she's not afraid to take on challenging roles. In 2019, she starred in the action-packed thriller, Jolt, as a woman with a rare neurological disorder that causes her to have uncontrollable anger outbursts. Beckinsale expertly balances vulnerability and toughness in this role, delivering bone-crunching fight scenes and hilarious one-liners with ease. In 2020, she starred in the dark comedy Emma as the snobbish and manipulative Lady Susan Vernon. Beckinsale's deliciously conniving performance earned critical acclaim and proved that she's just as adept at comedy as she is at action. And just when you thought she couldn't get any cooler, Beckinsale then starred in the action horror film Jolt, where she played a vampire warrior battling against werewolves in a gritty underworld. Her fierce fighting skills and icy stare made her the ultimate badass in this dark and thrilling world. Her roles in the 2022 film Prisoner's Daughter and the 2023 film Fool's Paradise are definitely worth watching. Through it all, Kate Beckinsale has continued to captivate audiences with her talent, beauty, and fearlessness, proving that she is truly a force to be reckoned with. Wondering why some of your favorite actresses quit acting? Click on the screen to see why.